Yeah. Yeah. How long have you fasted today? It's like four hours uh, away from the end. Okay. Okay, cool. Um, you said you're the only one who's telling the truth. Can you teach us why Islam is the truth? I want to know. Well, one thing I said is that it's uh, it's consistent with the Old Testament. How is that? Well, I read the Torah. I just felt like they were consistent with each other. Okay. Is your is your Allah a uh, a father to anyone? Uh, no. Okay. Well, the God of the Old Testament is father to mankind. So how is how are you going to say it's consistent with one another? Well, that's just one thing. But also, are you sure that in the Old Testament it calls itself father? Yes. I don't know. Yes. Of course. Yes. So how are we are we going to uh, say something and uh, basically make a cake and eat it too? I mean you said Well, that's just said, one thing. It doesn't no, mean No, it's it's very it's important thing, important. right? I mean we're talking about God. It's not that important. Of course it's important. Well, maybe God stopped uh, calling himself father because people would uh So you know, Allah, so are you telling me divinity. So are you telling me that your Allah changed his mind? Well, can God change his like, mind? That's not the point. It's more like uh, changing it uh, so that people, like for example, Jews would say God is only our father or something, you know. So God would change it just so that uh, no, people no, no, won't no. corrupt. God, no, no, no. God himself, God himself says, I'm father. It's in the Old Testament. Yeah, I know. Uh, so but, how how are you going to deal with that? Because you say basically what you're saying is, all of the Quran is the same God of the Old Testament. That's what you're basically is. saying. But how how are you going to make that claim? Well, your Allah is father to no one, and God of the Old Testament it's is father small, to everyone. Like detail. No, it's not very small. We're like talking about God. The, <laughs> if you compare it to like, no, no, no. Are you are you are you now laughing? Are you laughing because you know that you what you said no, no, does no, not make sense? Because you take such a small thing. It's not small. Like, it's not small. Like, oh, if you compare it to look no, no, no. Christian, are you laughing? Are you laughing because oh, no. you know are you are busted? I'm laughing because you're a Christian, and if you look at Christianity and you compare it to the Old Testament, there's way more huge differences than oh, no, no, just no, the stick. father thing. That's such no, a small no, no, thing. No, 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 no. It's very. Ask a Jew himself, no, 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 no. It's not a small thing. You're laughing about yourself, right? Because you know you're. No, busted, I'm laughing right? because look, if I were to ask a Jew what is more consistent, he'd probably say Islam, I think. But I, uh, I can't bro, prove bro, that. Is there, is, there, is there something wrong? You, you, you made a claim. You made a claim. And I asked you, is Allah a father to anyone? You said no. But God of the, of the Old Testament, he is the father. Look what it says here. This is Isaiah. That doesn't change that. It's yes, it's, consistency. No, it changed everything. This is God we're no, talking about. Look what it says, Isaiah 64, I, uh, or right, verse so 8. Say, it says, uh, but wait, now, uh, our Lord, thou art our father. You right, let's it? say, in theory, Prophet Muhammad's a false prophet. Yes, but he is. He's teaching some a similar... All right, let's he say is, he is. Wait, wait. Let he me give you another example. Deuteronomy... Wait, wait, wait. Deuteronomy 32, no I, verse 6, it says, Do yes, do, require the Lord, O foolish people and unwise. Is not he thy father? You see that? So... All right, but let's say that God is uh, true, the one of the Old Testament, right? And the Quran one isn't true. Uh, would God put us in hell, even though we followed Islam and it's uh, pretty similar to the Old Testament? But it's not, because we are talking about the God here. The God of the Old Testament is Father. The God of the Quran, Allah, That's is not a Father. Small, it's that. not small. We are talking about God. I, is, bro, right, so uh, bro, bro, I, went to, I, have, I have a question. What did you What did you smoke? What did you smoke this morning? What did you Hold smoke? On. Let's say. Uh, did you let's say I went lay, after bro, me. lay the pipe let's down? Stop the argile. Stop, <laughs> stop smoking shisha, I man. Let's say I went to the afterlife, and then God's like, "Oh, but I'm the father. You're going to hell because you don't think I'm the father." Is that what's gonna happen? Well, realistically, 
well we are talking about uh, who God is and God is father of mankind so it makes a lot of sense to show you that if we are talking about a different God here. your Allah is a different God than the Old Testament uh, how about in your you speak the language of the Bible right what is the word they use is it really father is yes. it like something Al-Ab. yeah Al-Ab. Al-Ab. the father that's how we call him You see, even Jews right. call their God Father. It's in the yeah, Old Testament. Yeah, I know they do. So, are we going to eat, make a cake and eat it too? Or what What's what uh, are we going to do here? After I'm done fasting, we could eat the cake. Okay. So here again, Deuteronomy 14, verse 1. It says, You, ye are the children of the Lord your God. You shall not cut yourselves. Right? No, 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 we no. are children. It's like a small detail. It's not small detail. What's wrong with you? I mean, who knows? Bro, bro, they, I have a question. I have, I have a question. Did you put? Maybe uh, they changed it. Did you put hashish in your uh, shisha this morning? No, I don't smoke. You don't smoke? Well, clearly you do because you don't see that Why this is a big problem. It's not a big problem. Of it's course, such a small detail. it's <laughs> small detail. Okay, can I be a Muslim and call Allah Father? Uh, I'd say no. Okay, so thank you very much. I mean, it's not small. You can still either. be a Muslim, so but you probably shouldn't call it father. No, either either we're going to be a Muslim and not call Allah a liar, or you're going to be a Muslim and call Allah a father to no one. It's not a small detail, my friend. For you, because you know you're busted, now you need <coughs> to lie and say it's small detail because you thought no, all this time yes yes yes, yes 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 you said i have i'm the only one with the truth clearly your shiuch have lied to you and told you that the god of islam allah is the same god of the old testament they lied to you and yes. you thought you said you thought that you could come here and not be busted by you. i busted you with a small detail and this detail that you s call very small is very important because god either god is father or he's not father so it's not small. And you clearly said wow. you can't be a Muslim. You can't be a Muslim if you call Allah Father. That means you are basically I mean, you could still be no, one, no, because you are going to place you are going to place in Islam sons equal to Allah, and that's shirk. Shirk is a no-no in Islam, right? Yeah. Right. It's a no-no. So, so again, that means. We have a problem, right? Look what it says in the Quran, nine, ayah nine thirty. Sorry, uh, chapter nine thirty, and it says the Jews say Israel is the son of Allah, and the Christians say the Messiah is the son of Allah. That's their statement from their mouth. They imitate the saying of those who disbelieve before them. May Allah destroy them. So if you are going to say in Islam Allah has a son, Allah will destroy you. So it's not a small detail according to Allah. So who are you, Avaris, with all respect, who are you saying it's small what detail? You because your Quran, chapter 9, ayah 30, it says it's not a small detail because Allah will destroy people who call him having a son, who will call him, a, he's a father. Well, I mean, maybe that one is meaning like begat a son, you know what I mean? Like how no, no, Greek no, religion no, 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 no. has sons. You said, you like said, it's... Thing. You said to me, it's a small detail. Clearly, it's not small detail because Allah will destroy anyone who calls him a father. So, don't so you don't know. Okay. Thank you very much. You don't know. Again, so here, chapter 9, ayah 30, it says, May Allah destroy them. How are they deluded? But, so Allah is saying, may Allah destroy them. That doesn't really make sense, right? So here the Quran doesn't make sense. Because he says, oh, the, yeah. Jews say, the Jews say, the Jews say, is the son of Allah. And the Christians say, Al-Masih huwa ibn Allah. But that's their statement from their mouth. So who's the one talking? You said Allah. Then it says, may Allah destroy them. So Allah is saying, may Allah destroy them. That doesn't make sense, right? So clearly the one who wrote this ayah is not Allah, right? The one who gave this ayat to uh, Muhammad, he's not Allah. So clearly this is not the speech of Allah. Thank you very much. Again, another problem for you. And this is your I don't word. know. I think that's a translation problem. I'm going no, to have no, to look no, into no, it more. No, 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 no.
Even though so I don't know. I can't like, trust you, honestly. You, you don't seem like a very trustworthy guy. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. This is, this is your translation, not mine. I didn't translate this, right? Your Islamic Abdul's translated. Your brother's in Islam, right? I think when they... Do you think that when they translated, they put hashish in their uh, shisha? When they were translating? Maybe. Who knows, right? Maybe. So yeah, Allah, Allah, say, Allah says, may Allah destroy them. Wow. It makes sense, my friend. Islam makes sense. And the Quran makes sense. And now I want to sh say the Shahada after you go. To be honest with you. I'm convinced. Yalla, yalla. Really? Jo just go and do your homework. Yeah? Then come back. So t tell yourself, explain to yourself wh how uh, Allah is going to destroy anyone who calls himself father. Well, you, at the same time you claim that the, the God of uh, the Old Testament is the same one who is Allah. But he's not Allah because... God is father in the Old Testament, but in the Quran, Allah will destroy who is calling him the father of anyone, right? Then it says, may Allah destroy them. Then, uh, so Allah is saying, may Allah destroy them. How many Allahs are there in the Quran, man? Doesn't make sense. So go and do your homework and come back. Bye-bye.